planning, we all have been discussed about so many sectors of budget and we literally talk about prospects of budget. So today I am here to discuss about various consequences of this budget 2023. Uh, though we are saying that this budget 2023 is a fantastic budget because our, it caters to almost every sector of our society. It beautifully balances growth and fiscal consideration. We call it as an Amrit Kal budget also as it follows seven uh, sub rishis seven priorities. But as you all know that every coin has two sides. So similarly, this budget also has some other side which says certain consequences, certain points which has been missed by the government in this budget also, which creates a kind of a, a negativity among the bulk of the people over here. Basically, the first point which I would like to discuss is that, that they haven't made any efforts to improve the material conditions of bulk of the people. Why I am saying this and they are ignoring the suffering of the people, why I am saying this, that they have not done anything for the increasing increased rate of employment. As we are saying, as you all have discussed that they have cut down Manrega scheme by one third. Even though they have cut down food subsidies also to up to one third percentage. So that is why the bulk of the people over here like rural people are showing negativity towards this budget because instead of growing them up, they are just cutting down the budget. I don't know what is the perspective of uh, government out of this, but till now, this is the negativity or the consequences of this budget among the majority of the people because this is the basic ground of the common people because they want employment, one thing, and another thing, they want food at a subsidized rate. And in both the sectors, government didn't did anything, mm -hmm. right? Another point of discussion is that the much celebrated public health insurance scheme, which is normally called as PM Suraksha Health Insurance. They have not done anything in that also, in spite of increasing the budget into that, which was supposed to be 10,000 crore, they have reduced it down to 3365 crores, this budget estimate. So what would happen to the unfortunates? How would they be able to cover up their insurance, which is being uh, just introduced in the market with the pomp and show with the call as insurance scheme, public health insurance scheme given by Pradhan Mantri, right? So this is also one of the consequences which has not covered up in, under this budget. Another is on agriculture sector. The one is that market intervention scheme, you might be knowing, those who have presented uh, the presentation on agriculture sector, market intervention scheme which is being introduced or which is being announced the previous year which says that if the farmer